Hey friends, so I'm about to start this project in my master bedroom. Please excuse the mess, we've been cleaning and we've been trying to get this wall prepped and ready for this design. And I wanna introduce you to my partner. She is actually the brains behind this project. So tell us, what did you want to do with this project? Like what was your vision when we started this? Anything tropical. I love the beach and I wish we were at the beach. So anything tropical and with some colors. And I told them, free reign with the design. There we go. So I created the design and she was the brains behind the project and that's why we make such a perfect duo, right? So anyways, I'm about to show you guys the process. Stay tuned and can't wait to show you. All right, so before we get started, for a project like this, you're going to need certain supplies in order for you to get this residential mural started. So first and foremost, we get our paint and you get your different sizes according to how much you need. You're gonna need your paint trays, smaller paint trays for small designs, and of course, this is for my big background. And you're gonna need a smaller roller. These right here, you don't really need these, but these were for um, furniture sliding, just in case uh, we need to move the furniture. I don't want them sliding anywhere. And of course, you need your frog tape to get the clean lines. Then we have this bad boy, and this is the roller for the, for the wall. And then we have our mixer just for mixing the paint. the coat for the background and I am so excited to show my partner. So Keener, come back and see. Tell me what you think. Oh wow. Come in, come in, come in. What do you think? Do you like, like it? it? Yeah? Yeah? yeah. Like it's, like, it. It's, it's looking to parts so like what do you like? Yeah. Okay, so good. So good. Good, good. Like Which is good because sometimes he starts something and I don't like it. See, this is like my worst critic. I, 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 there's nothing I can do in this house or any of art that she just like doesn't like. I'm joking. She loves it all. Yeah. Stuff. We are going to possibly, you may give it a second coat. I'm not sure yet. We're kind of waiting to see how it like turns out. And we'll take it from there. Stay tuned. Now I'm going to take a projector and project my design onto the wall in order to trace it so that I can then apply the paint. I'm gonna do this in different layers so that one of the layers dries and then the next layer will do the same exact thing. We'll get the projector out, apply the design on the wall, do the same exact thing, paint it, let it dry, and then the third layer. So there's three layers to this design and you're gonna see as I show you. So stay tuned. Okay, 
so it's official. We're completely done. Day three. I'm exhausted. I think I actually caught a cold during this whole entire process. I don't know if it was for doing this, but I'm like sick and I'm like done. I don't want to paint for the next four or five days. But anyways, I want to get my partner in here and I want to show her what she thinks and what, you know, give us, give us a, give us a rundown. What do you think? I love it. You love it? I absolutely love it. Nice. It came out. Yep. Nice, nice. Do you like the colors? Yeah. It's yeah. like crazy what color can do to like just transform a room. Absolutely. Like just one wall. Yeah. Absolutely. I'm very, very happy with it. So we're actually gonna, we're still not done putting everything back in place. We're trying to figure out how we want the room to look, but um, here it is. This is it. 